Since Repair Clinic encourages you to perform this repair safely, a warning icon will appear when you should use caution. Before you replace the choke lever on your leaf blower, make sure the engine has cooled. Next, you should remove the wire and boot from the spark plug to prevent the engine from accidentally starting. Lift the tab to detach the air filter cover. Use a T20 Torx bit to unthread the two mounting screws, securing the filter base and carburetor. Then remove the filter base. Now unthread the screw, securing the choke lever to the choke plate, and remove the old lever. Install the new choke lever by positioning it on the air filter base. Reposition the choke plate and thread the screw to secure the choke lever to the plate. Reinsert the screws into the filter base, then align the carburetor. Confirm the insulator gasket is in place, then position the carburetor and filter base and thread the screws to secure. Make sure the air filter gasket is properly positioned on the filter base, then realign the cover and snap it into place. Reattach the wire and boot to the spark plug and your leaf blower should be ready for use.